Joey's log. Day seven. It's cold. I've sat here alone in agony. Miserable. Waiting for this moment. The moment where I get to react to your photos and videos. Nah. You actually thought I was sitting next to a campfire? Oh, come on. Come on. You actually thought that? Let me know in the comments below. I wanna hear it. I wanna hear it. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, I've been just playing around with my LC500 from Kodox. I absolutely love this freaking light stick. There's so many different features that you can just play around with. And um, yeah, I really want to make a short film later this spring. This freaking stick just keeps giving me all these funky ideas that I really, really want to try. So yeah, enough with this light. I'll just put it away. Okay, how's it going y'all? It is awesome to see you tune back in. And yes, like I said, today is the day. The day when we jump into the long exposure challenge I set out for you guys. The challenge was to create photos or videos with that same long exposure light show method as I did on my latest video. Anything and everything from product photos to videos or short stories utilizing this technique. And oh man, oh man, did you guys deliver. You guys really went to town with all your videos and photos. And without further ado, on with the first one. I asked Palma, show what you got, man. Okay. Damn. Oh snap, man. Yo. Dude, you went above and beyond with this one, man. It's crazy to think about that this has been created out of still photos. It is insane, dude. Bro, this is gnarly, man. This is amazing work. Already with the first film, Ayas Palma, man. You knocked it out of the park. Next, 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 next. Next, we got Benjamin Budai. Dude! So you stole your girlfriend's perfume for this one, eh? Ooh, snap! Yo, bro. With the final shot, you brought in this uh, light trail method. That's dope, dude. I, I love the fact that you made like traditional filmmaking and then mixed together with this light trail method in the end with the hero shot. That's well done. And I really feel that because you did that, in the end, it really, really pops out as well. Glad you took upon this challenge, dude. This was this was great to see. Mm. Then there was quite a few really cool product photos that I really, really enjoyed, especially this one starting off with Rapida. This was um like to my eyes, like very, very elegant, somewhat like fragile almost because of the light trails that you created. And then on the reflective surface, you see a little bit of that as well. Nicely done, man. Tony G. Damn, man. It's cool how the light trail goes like around our product as well. It's all like blended, connected together. And the color that you chose for your light trail is really, really cool. Really makes your product pop. And then we got this monster energy photo that just freaking boom, explodes. I know it might look like a massive mess to some people, but for me, like what, what I'm thinking is like explosion, pure energy. Like if I have a sip, that's how I would feel. These are super amazing, well thought photos you guys are creating. Damn, I'm feeling inspired because of you guys. I love this. Now we got a little bit of something else. We got something else. We got something else. Created by Harry Rom. We got a baby Yoda. What is he doing? Oh snap. First of all, I freaking love Mandalorian. This what you created just reminded me like how much I love that show. But anyways, like this is, this is like, this is thinking outside the box, dude. Dude, imagine if like on your next video, like you maybe brought the doll alive as well, like with maybe stop motion animation and then you added that light trail thing. You kinda, you kinda gave me an idea here, man. I love it, thanks, thanks for that. Up next, up next, I saw a couple of car related posts 
Let's start off with this one. This is this is <laughs> this is by my brother. Dude, you actually you actually did amazing here. Because of the reflective surface of the car, that also made the car pop out from this otherwise just dark space parking lot. I'm not sure where you were. Dude, you better print out a photo and uh frame that and bring it bring that over here at the studio, man. And the car as well. I'd love to have one of those Porsches. Oh my god. Okay, we'll do we'll do one more. We'll do one more. There's this car video. It's by Henrik. Show us what you got, dude. Ooh! Bam! This is a sexy car as well. I'm not gonna lie. I love I love Tesla. Ah, dude, it's so mean. Ooh, dude, I could just loop it forever. Seriously, it's so freaking mean. Ooh. Yo. Yo, would have been great to see some BTS from this. 100%, 100%. If you got some, dude, post it. Tag me, I wanna see it, man. Ooh. Wow, guys, just freaking wow. And with that freaking Tesla, oh. And with that Tesla video, that is it for this video. Thanks to every single one of you who sent out their creations. Just mwah. And for all you guys whose work I just went through on this video, I want to give away my lot pack just to say thank you for taking part in this challenge. There are just so many talented people out there. And as much as you guys like watching my videos, I also love watching yours. Truly, truly amazing work that also really inspires me. And with that, because I want to see more of the work that you guys also do, I'm putting another challenge out there. Challenge that goes back to my art of the 15 second commercial. Create a compelling 15 second ad, post it on your IG and tag me to your post. Now, I want to thank you for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys again on the next one. Take four. Ooh, it's cold. Ooh, snowing. Ooh, okay. Get into the character, you piece of sh- uh, uh.